shares. Today could either be a really, really, really sad day, or a really exciting one, or a really wild one. That's right, I am back from Hawaii, and I flew all the way here to Pennsylvania because I had to come address the spy wagon, G wagon. Oh, whoa, and check this out. We got a Jeep off-roading right now. Whoa, check this Jeep out. Hello. Yeah, that's right, shares. There is a lot going on here today. But shares, I'm thinking I may want to sell the spy wagon, G wagon. Yes, that's right, I may want to sell this car. I mean, this car is amazing. It's absolutely huge. It's almost eight feet tall. I mean, look how tall this thing is. It's absolutely massive. But I found another vehicle that's even more epic, in my opinion. You have to let me know, Shares. Should I sell the spy wagon? Yes or no? I need to check the comments right now. Yes, if I should sell it. No, if I should keep it forever. But to give you a hint on the car I'm looking at, it kind of has to do a little bit with this, but it's not this. And it's kind of like this, but not this. No, no, no. By the way, if you didn't see in my Tesla reveal wrap video, I wrapped my Tesla a Sherpa color. That's right, the world's first Sherpa wrap Tesla. And I'm actually giving away Sherpa wrap share the love stickers. So all you gotta do is on my video right here, comment down below Sherpa. But that's not what I'm looking for, Shares. Somewhere here, oh my goodness, this place is bigger than it was last time. This place is massive. Oh, whoa, wow. Uh, they must be building more or something. That is wild. There's nothing driving on the highway like that. Interesting. Okay, well, let's definitely go this way. What is down here? Oh, and check it out, Shares. Over here, they have a Lamborghini Mercia Lago. These things are actually pretty rare because obviously they don't make them anymore. All carbon fiber back here. The wing is massive. And then look at the exhaust on this thing. That is so crazy. And the coolest part about this, you can see the engine. How cool is that? Oh, yeah, that big V12. That looks so cool. <gasps> and there it is, Shares. I found it. Oh my goodness. Check it out. We got the Share the Love golf cart here all the way from the beach. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, take it for a little test drive. Let's see. Does this thing still work? Turn it on. <gasps> it's working. All right. Oh, it's good. It's good. It's good. Oh, yeah. It's working, Shares. What's up? I used to know it. Yes. My grandkids love you to death. Oh, yeah? Is it any way that I can get an autograph? Of love? course, of course. Thank you, thank yeah, you. Yeah, of course. I appreciate you. Definitely. <laughs> All right, Shares. We got to make sure this thing is fully working. Woo! By the way, Shares, if you ever do see me, don't be afraid to come up and ask for a picture or an autograph. I always love taking pictures and autographs with Epic Share Fam members. But remember, you gotta be a subscriber. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now and join the Share Fam. Let's get to 10 million subscribers. So the good news is the golf cart is working, Shares, and I wanna do a little customization. I may change the color. I may add some more Share the Love logos on it. It's gonna look so good, and don't worry, we will still be doing a last to leave golf cart challenge this summer. But Shares, we gotta run to my beach house real quick because Shares, you saw the the last time I was at the beach house, the railings were torn off the back deck and the elevator was broken. <gasps> Where did all the railings go? So let's hop in the G-Wagon, take it on a test drive, get to the beach house, fix everything so we're good to go, and then I'll show you the new car that I want to get. Oh yeah, we're off, Shares. Listen to that purr of that engine. Oh! Now let's turn up the radio, listen to Malibu Barbie, and we'll be in Avalon in no time. Woo! Oh, right, yeah. Be my Malibu Barbie. With your sun kiss, sun tan, Gucci on the waistband. Hello? What is that noise? Hello? It's coming from the top floor, Shares. <gasps> what? Whoa! The computer brains the elevator are open. What is this? Whoa! What is going on? Someone's hacking the elevator system. I told you about this last time, Shares. Someone hacked the elevator. Huh? Hello? Who's down here? Hello? Whoa, uh, excuse me. What are you doing? Oh, hey, Steven. Yeah, so, uh, we got a call that your elevator was broken. Wait, who called you? Uh, Steven, we're subscribers. We watched the vlog, so we came to fix it. Look at this. This cable's all loose. Someone came in here and hacked your system. Very dangerous, but don't worry. We're gonna get it fixed. By the way, what happened to your deck? Oh, oh, yeah, I don't know what happened to the deck. We gotta go check on the deck. Thank you so much for fixing it. All right, let's get outside. What does the deck look like? What is going on? <gasps> oh, there's caution tape everywhere. Whoa, what is this? What is this? Oh, my goodness. What is going on to the house? Whoa, uh, okay. The house is looking good, Shares. We got the railings back on, but uh, it looks like the workers have been here and they are putting the house back together, which is great news because it's just about in time for summer. This water will be popping in no time. We'll have slip and slides going down here, jumping off the end. <laughs> We will have the jet skis in the water. It's gonna be so, 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 so much fun. But Shares, I'm not here to stay just yet. No, 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 no. But where I am going is going to be super, super, super warm and always summer year round. I'm about to hop on a plane to check out the new vehicle that I may or may not get, but again, it's up to you. Now let's hop on the plane, let's go to Florida. And just like that, we are now in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Woo! 
And check out this room, it also has an amazing view. Oh yeah, that beautiful blue ocean. And I would open the door, but I cannot figure out how to get it open. Oh, check out this brand new vehicle. I am super, 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 super excited to go and check it out. It, it's gonna be absolutely incredible. I've never seen one of these in real life, so I really don't know what to expect. So Sherry, you are going to witness it firsthand with me. A little banana for good luck. Mm, sorry, let's go, we're gonna be like. Oh, there's some cool muppets here, but nope. This is not what we're going to see. We're going to see something way more epic. Oh yeah, and just like that, we are here, Shares. We are at SoFlo Jeeps, which is Southern Florida Jeeps, and they do some of the coolest things ever, and I'm gonna show you what they have here that I think may be the next vehicle to get in the collection. So, to give you a little hint of why I'm here, I'm not here to get a Jeep, no, 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 no. I'm here to get something way cooler, like way cooler. Okay, so this is a Jeep six by six, but the thing I'm about to get does not look anything like that. Shares, today we are here to test drive one of these things. Oh my goodness. Woo! Yeah, if you haven't already, make sure to smash the like button right now. So in here is where they actually make the 6x6. So this is just a standard Jeep that they cut, they extended, and they have the six wheels that still looks pretty lame. They're still in the process of building it. And they take the interior and completely rip it apart. Like this is what an inside of a Jeep looks like. It almost looks like this Jeep got in an accident. Without it being lifted and all this stuff, kind of looks a little dinky. Oh, this one is getting closer to being a 6x6. This one's almost done being built, but not completely built. Oh, it's just got the Hemi. 750 horsepower. Whoa, okay. That's right, shares. and today, we are going to test drive this Apocalypse 6x6. Check this thing out. Oh, yeah. This is what I'm talking about. I can't even describe what this thing is. It looks so cool. It has her full 40-inch rims. It's got a green Kevlar coating. This thing is so cool. I cannot wait to test drive this thing. Oh my goodness, just look at this thing. It's absolutely massive. You can not only choose the exterior color, the rim color, the trim color, but you can also choose the interior color. Like, check out the interior of this thing. Oh my goodness, what in the world? Purple interior, purple on the roof, purple down here, purple on the steering wheel, purple on the dashboard. There's even a giant iPad, what? Just like that, how cool is this? And you have an eight foot bed. Okay, let's go inside real Let's look at the other color shares. You gotta comment down below which color you like the best. Check out all these epic interior colors. Like you can do orange, you can do lime green, you can do blue, and they have like crocodile leather looking type print. Oh, this is so cool. There are so many options. Oh my goodness, look at this one. This is a gray with lime green accents. No way, look at the front grill here. It's a lime green front grill that they're gonna put on this one. Okay, this is kind of along the lines of what I wanna do for mine. This looks so good. This is the beige color. It looks pretty good. It looks like Carter. Hummer H1, kind of like a sand dune color. So this is definitely an option. Whoa. Check out the interior on this one, shares. Whoa. Okay, the interior on this 6x6 looks futuristic. It looks like Mars or something. Yeah, I'm really starting to like the gray color ones. Now, shares, I'm thinking, let's take this thing for an epic test drive around Florida. This is going to be so cool. Be my Malibu Barbie with your sun kiss, sun tan, Gucci on the way. Man, Sharers, this thing looks so good. Look at it next to a semi. This thing looks massive. Oh my goodness. Also, Sharers, he told me to drive right up to the beach. Like, I don't think we're allowed to park here, but uh, he was like, just drive up here, let's get some photos. So we're gonna take some awesome photos now. Okay, and now let's get to the airport so I don't miss my flight back home. Oh yeah, there it goes, Sharers. Apocalypse is taking off. Ooh, yeah, that car is so wild. By the way, remember, comment down below if I should get the 6x6 or keep the G-Wagon. I need to know. Also, what color should I do? I have so many questions. Put your comments down below. I can't wait to read them. I'm not heading back to LA just yet. I'm actually heading to the original Sheriff Fam house to visit my mom and Grace and visit Grace's roommate. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and get ready for next vlog. Until then, you know what to do. Stay awesome and share the love. Peace. Woo!